Cyprus. Oh, I can't see it at all. So we just picked up our rental car. Liam's driving, obviously I'm not driving. Flight was grand. We got a surprise COVID test when we landed. Uh, Lance first. Yeah, my first one that wasn't expected. I had like seven. <laughs> Liam's had 400, he's a professional. Honestly, I, I felt like the mouth swab was worse than the nose swab. So if anyone was interested in my thoughts. We've like a 40 minute drive now to our Airbnb where we're gonna be Kay, who owns the Airbnb. The fella like out in the car park where you pick the car up from, he was so funny, he was American. He was like, okay, so this is your car. He was like, blah, blah. Sorry, I won't do an American. I was gonna say, he was like, only thing, just bring it back full. You've we got like insurance for 70 for the four days. He was like, drive it like you stole it because you don't have to pay for anything. So uh, we're not gonna do that, but like it's good to know. We're that. probably gonna Liam wants to try find Taco Bell. I do not want to eat that. I, d I don't I don't feel like that's something I need in my life. I'd rather a McDonald's, so we'll see where we end up. Can open that big bar again. Oh god, I'm so much in. That was the best thing I've eaten in so long. That was unreal. I don't know if you can hear me because it's windy again. We just went for dinner about four hours ago. From a movie scene to main of people in my dreams. And we went to a cocktail bar for a few drinks. A few drinks. Uh, I got a nice one in a shark. <laughs> I'll insert the picture here. Liam got a normal looking one, but they sprayed perfume rose. on it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're just walking back now. It's about a half an hour walk. We're gonna get some I'm a celeb going. Yeah. With some catch we up need to catch up. But this is like the cooler Slum part of mind. town. Yeah, and then we're in like the Ballymun Flats area. <laughs> That's what I'd say. But the Airbnb lady is lovely, Kay. 10 out of 10. Ledge. She's great. Tomorrow. We have to get up. Liam's getting a haircut because it's the state of him. And then we're going to Paphos and see what's there. Might go for a swim. Again. Me. Yeah. Not Karen. I, I got in up to my waist, right? That's she enough. She dabbled. That's enough. She dabbled. I don't need to get the top half wet. It's too much. Oh, it's not warm enough, so. And yeah, so see you tomorrow. See you tomorrow. Welcome to our uh, Limassol apartment tour that I forgot to do when we came here first so I'm doing it now when we're leaving there's all of our bags she said she decorated for Christmas for us this is the takeaway we got the first night and we're trying to figure out if it's in other places in Cyprus because if it is, we're going there again. Come through here to the kitchen. We have everything, washing machine as well. This is the bathroom, very big. This is Liam's room. I let him have the double bed because he's been in hostels for a long time. So he has a lovely dresser. He can sit and do his makeup. And then you have shutters as well. This was my room. Table, beds. As you can see, I slept in this one. 
that's it really we're driving to nicosia today which is like the capital city so i'm gonna drive there i think we're going to a shopping center oh my god the thunder and lightning last night was so loud it actually woke me up this morning as well the thunder did So we're going to go to a shopping centre until it stops raining and then we can go explore Nicosia. Do you want to do some commentary? Baby? How did you find driving yesterday by yourself? Uh, I think I'm a better driver than Karen so far. That's rude. No, it was fine. The driving was fine. It was uh, They're lovely and smooth on the roads, good roads and stuff. I thought it'd be worse than it is. As you can see, we've lovely weather. Which way am I going? Turn right. Okay. I'm following him, I don't care where we're going, we're following him. <laughs> Tesco! Meow meow meow! Meow meow meow! <laughs> wow. No one ever got fat from one cookie, that's what it says. <gasps> Nick Carol wouldn't like this, no one ever got skinny from one salad. <gasps> Welcome to our new room! In Nicosia, or what was the other word for? Left. Left Cozia, but we're gonna call it Nicosia because we prefer that. So you walk in and they have lovely carpet wardrobe. Do you want to demonstrate the bed? Wow. And we're just gonna go on a walk around now. Liam, I think it's rain. It is rain, yeah. It's like being back at home. <laughs> Hello. We're en route to the old town, trying to avoid the border and the no man's land. Well, Liam wants to go to it. No, no, I'm okay. I don't want to go. <laughs> He's changed his mind. So it's like three or four now, is it? Uh, 20 to four. Yeah. So we're just going to walk around and we need to make ourselves go to sleep early tonight and wake up early tomorrow because then the day after that, our flight to Rome slash Athens is at like 5 a.m. Yeah. So we'll have to get up at like one or two, so. She says her needs to sleep, sleep for Ireland she does. I am the one that will struggle, so. This area is nice. Yeah, cause it's older buildings and stuff. It's nice. It looks, I don't know, it doesn't really look Greek, I don't think. Um, a little it's bit. It's a bit different. A little bit different. Yeah. More kind of like Mediterranean, kind yeah. of like Spanish-y. Yeah, that's the, the kind of vibe I'm getting. Of course that does, cause that's a tapas bar, so it's <laughs> Spanish but. This is for Catherine. Mail for two in our VIP area with some tunes. <laughs> You've got now I will feel the ocean through. And I pray that it won't be over soon. Oh my, I miss the sun. Wait, it won't be too long till we arrive the coming day. We've arrived at our final resting place in Cyprus. <laughs> <laughs> this place is actually really nice. It's a hostel. Uh, it's kind of like down some random back roads. <laughs> but it's nice. I'll show you our room. These are the doors.
the view. And then obviously the bathrooms are shared, they're across the hall. I'm not gonna film in there, cause that's weird. So we're just gonna go to the beach now, have a little swim. Please ignore my restless face, cause it's so hard to keep it all together ever since we left. I guess it just makes sense to it. So I'm just here sitting on the beach. Um, Liam went out for a walk. Well, we went to the beach earlier, tried to swim, but there was all this stuff in the water. Then we went back, he had a shower and he went out for a walk and I did Pilates and then I had a shower. Um, so now I'm hungry, so I'm gonna get food and then we have to drop the car back to the airport and then I'd say Liam will have food when we get back. And we have to get up at like 2 a.m. tomorrow to get to the airport for three, to get a flight at five. And we have to get two flights as well. So it's two two hour flights, which isn't too bad. And we only have like an hour and a half in Athens airport to wait. So it's not too bad, but it's just, it's very early. So when we get to Rome tomorrow, we will be having a nap, but I'm gonna go get food now. I don't know where I'm gonna eat. I don't know what I'm in the mood for. I was just kind of walking along the seafront and I still don't know what I want. So we'll see what I end up with. Eat it. What? Cheat on top. I can move it holder. <laughs> oh yeah. Cut it up. Yeah. <laughs> and go. No need to be stressed. Gotta take it focus there. I really miss the shade of blue. Five AM Cyprus time and we're just on the plane. We've been up since about two. Woo! On the way to Rome. We have to get two flights. So hopefully we don't miss our second one. In the unlikely event of a sudden loss of air pressure, oxygen masks will drop from the panel above your seat. Remain seated and pull the mask towards you. Press it against your mouth and nose and continue to breathe normally. A life jacket is stowed under your seat. When instructed to do so by the crew, pull the life jacket over your head, attach the strap to the hook in front, and pull tight. 